are not here to serve and protect. We're here to seek and destroy. Cumbla.org, baby. Big! The following video is brought to you in part by the Cop Block Network, helping advance the message that badges don't grant extra rights. Visit copblock.org slash network for more details. So we're out here in Columbus and there's a police checkpoint this way. We're gonna head down there and uh, get a little footage, let them know that uh, we're gonna be cop blocking it. And so we got about six or seven people out here and uh, hopefully we can get uh, a good uh, night of safety happening, keep people out of this warrantless checkpoint for no reason, so. Hey, look. <laughs> These businesses are going to get anything done. Pretty good, how are you guys? Good, good. What's going on tonight? I'm sorry? What's going on tonight? Uh, it's Friday checkpoint. I thought it was an OVI checkpoint. This guy's checking for expired stickers. Yeah. And now he's doing an illegal search. I thought you had a warrant to look at people's property. Look at this guy. Right? Fuck your Fourth Amendment. This guy's like, I will take a shit on your constitution. I got bads too. What's this guy doing? Hey, you don't have to let him search your vehicle. I got bads. Pull it over. Pull it over, man. I got bads. Pull it over, man. I got bads. <laughs> oh, look, they're stopping a family. Oh, yeah, look. Yeah, look at him. He's going to search a family. Yeah. Out for dinner. Yeah, she's terrified of you. Am I being detained or am I free to go? Scott doesn't have any right to look in your car. What are you looking for? I don't know. Flower? Their soul? I mean, there's a rapper over here if you're looking to, like, pin me for something. Yeah, you're right. What was that all about? Thought a major crime had been committed? Uh, not a major crime. Did a worm steal something? Why? Why what? It's okay. It's okay. It's yeah, his yeah. first amendment. I'm not worried about it. Thank you. I'm not I just worried. think you guys have a lot better things to do as public servants. <laughs> you know, grass can only grow at a certain speed, and if it doesn't, they tase it. Oh, that's deep. <laughs> that's deep. Hey, you guys don't have to answer his questions. You know that, right? You don't have to answer any questions. Especially the passenger. No. 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 Don't tell him anything. You don't have to. Oh, we screwed up their plans. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's not cool. I'm gonna go talk to her. Get back on the sidewalk. Huh? Get back on the sidewalk. Is that why? Because you're just interfering you. with this. Get back on the sidewalk. You just approached me. I wasn't Get doing anything to you, man. I don't know why you're yelling right at me. Hey, why are you pro right why are you uh why are you harassing those people? <laughs> this guy's trying to intimidate you. And they're punishing these people for talking to us. He's just being a dick. That's it. That's all. That's all. got nothing better to do. There's people out there killing people and you all the police out here checking cars. For now, the It's supposed to be for drunk driving, not seatbelts. 
right, that's exactly. And, and he ain't drunk, he ain't drunk nothing. It's just money for them. He probably pulled you in here because you talked to us. Probably, probably, that's all. They do that's shitty all. things like that. Right. Well, stealing. Yeah. Stealing from people. Right, that's it. They got no Take $100 out of your family's pocket for them. Trying to get their quote. Now, who do you guys represent? Oh, I, I love this website called coplock.org. Have you heard about coplock? Uh uh. Really? Like us on, fa on Facebook. Yeah. <laughs> There's even a Welcome Leo's page, coplock.org oh, cool. slash Welcome Leo. We love cops, actually. Good cops. You know what? Um, this is a this actually is good stuff. If I get pulled over by an officer, you know, I expect courtesy. Right. As a citizen, right? Just like you guys do. And uh, well, sometimes I don't. I expect not even to be pulled over. It, well. But we hope that if you're getting pulled over, like I would never over. expect that, like in the freest country in the world, that you would just get randomly stopped while like driving home from the grocery store. Come on, this this is you know this is bullshit. Stopping people assuming they're drunk. Well, it's not. It, it, it's a good it's a good deterrent, and we hope that even if one person says, you know what, I know there's a checkpoint, I'm gonna stay home, I'm gonna stay off the road, then, then I think. But we, some would say like uh, hitting a kid is a deterrent too. No. That's yeah, like if they do bad behavior and you spank them, you know, like that's the turn. Oh, you're talking about discipline. Okay. That's, well, yeah. discipline, that's hitting a person, right? I'm just saying is like, just because that might be true doesn't mean that's the best recourse, right? All right. Well, it depends. I mean, but you know, so I, can I persuade you just to like let everybody drive by tonight? <laughs> no. Or how about if they need a ride, <laughs> if they're drunk and like they got this far, I'll get them the rest of the way that's home. A, that's uh, actually a good point. If we catch them, if you catch anyone tonight, can we give them a ride home and you guys don't arrest them? No, you know? we'll, we'll have to deal with them. Oh, no, but, no. I'll just give them a ride home. That's pretty noble of you guys. By the way, this is the, the group. It's called Save, Save Your Victim. And she's going to give out vouchers. So if, you know, people coming out of the bars, and they're going right. to do it, I think, uh, in the arena district. So people coming out of the bars uh, will have an opportunity to get a free ride home. Right. See, that would so, be a much better use of money than, like, I don't know how much this costs, but I know you guys aren't cheap. Oh, we're not. Is, is, we'll, we'll help you out with your checkpoint tonight. If there's anything other than driving, <laughs> you know, you, you let these people off, you know. There's a good example of a minor violation, no headlights right there. Okay. Sorry, is that guy going to get her? Oh, look, and they're going to get her. Tell him to let her go. Oh, good work. Did not get diverted. How do you like that? That makes me happy. See? That's cool. See? That's cool. See? But I wonder if it happened only because we were here. No. <laughs> no. It's possible. That's yeah, all I'm going to edit the video. Cool. That, I like that. If this trip <laughs> Just is kidding. really about drunk driving, you should don't give tickets to people for seat belts or anything like that. That would okay. be at least a step in the right direction. I and yeah. I could give you a bunch of yeah. cop lock stickers you can give, or a bumper, or wait, business cards you can give them all. You can give every car that drives through a business card. Well, I wish we could do that. We well, don't uh, hate cops. Don't I hate. really appreciate people who exercise the First Amendment of the Constitution, because I'm a believer in the Constitution, just okay. like you guys are. So, it's a good thing that, that we have young men like you out here. You know, you're just, you're doing your part, and, and we get that. But we have to do our part as well. And, well, and, and like I said, I'm you don't so really have to. I mean, you could yeah. get another job. But <laughs> True. That's <laughs> it. You're basically stopping everyone with no probable cause. So it's a, vi it's a clear violation here. Now, if you observed someone driving erratically and drunk, that gives you probable cause. But this, to me, in my eyes, this is completely unconstitutional. Well, it, it's constitutional because the Supreme Court of the United States says it's constitutional. So and, nine, and you know nine guys in black dresses say that. I mean, come on, that's not justice. Well, you know, they think it is. Yeah. All right. Well, we're hoping that we can have you send half of those guys home because we're going to try to divert as many people from this traffic stop as possible. <laughs> When you're in our county and you want to drive, just remember to go 55. Cause all around the county every woman and man knows we'll pull you over just to play our banjos. Before you cross the street you better look both ways or we'll throw you in the pokey for a dozen 
Sundays. Be a shipment of cop block cards to hand out to folks that get slowed down long enough to, to take one. Bitch! Come on, you donut fuckers! We're wearing our masks just for fun. Because we think it's funny. Do not go straight forward. There are six in front of you. What's that? Fuck the police! And always remember, fuck the police! And that's the plan, Joe.